welcome back to my channel my name is stephanie before we get started lord i come before you humble giving you thanks and giving you praise holy spirit i said you touch the people ears to hear and the heart to receive your word oh god my prayers oh god that you will continue to increase your people discernment oh god that we won't believe everything that we see nor hear oh god but lord god we will take those things back to you oh god and see what you have to say about a thing or a situation oh god or situations in the mighty name of jesus to you be the glory, to you be the honor, O oh God. Lord, I thank you for going ahead of us, O oh God. Showing us things, showing your people things, O oh God. Revealing secrets, O oh God. Things that are hidden in the dark, O oh God. You're bringing them to the light, O oh God. And for that, I give you thanks and I give you praise, O oh God. I ask, O oh God, if someone is watching that doesn't know you, I pray for their salvation. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. With that being said, if it's anything about this channel that you like, please subscribe. If it's anything about this video that you like, hit the like button. With that being said, let's move on. I come on to share this dream that I had. In this dream, it was my daughter. She ordered a pizza from Papa John. The delivery guy came to deliver the pizza, but I noticed it was two guys. One of the guys was huge in size. The other guy was a normal size. She opened, my daughter opened the door to go out to get the pizza. It was like right in the front, front of the door. The guy had parked close to the house. I didn't feel right about that. Like this, this feeling came upon me like right away. So I went behind her because it didn't feel right. So when I got to the door, the big guy say, you don't need to come out and held the door. He was huge. He was really huge though. They kidnapped her, put in her in the car. I was able to see that as I kept trying to open the door. Finally, I was able to open the door. They had drove off. As they were driving off, I saw this tag on the car. I noticed the numbers on the tag. It was like numbers on the tag. But then I noticed before the numbers, it was a, a, a Chinese, a China symbol. It was a China, China, Chinese symbol on it, followed by numbers. So I ran behind the car. The only reason I was able to catch up to it, because it made another stop. So I told, I was able to go, tell my daughter, come on, come on, hurry up, hurry up. She was scared. So she wouldn't, she froze up, she wouldn't move. So I continued to tell her, come on, hurry, 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 before they come back, hurry up. Once I convinced her, she said her hands was tied. But she said, wait, I think I'm able to get it. So she was able to free her hands. Then I told her to come on, run. As she tried to run, she noticed that her foot was changed to another girl's foot. It was three girls in all. So she ran as fast as she could, being chained to someone else. I was able to free her but I don't know what happened to the other two girls. They got out the car as well. Now, Papa John, it seemed like from this dream, from this dream, I felt in my spirit, they behind trafficking. And it's somehow connected to China. And not only that, I was on a fast, a seven day fast. And the last day of that fast, I drive fast during the day and I had a, a dinner at night, like one meal. I drive fast and I had one meal. And it was the strangest thing when I, my, my other daughter ended up ordering a pizza from Papa John. Ended up having a slice, just one slice of pizza. And I kid you not, as long as I stayed within the cheese and the meat, the sausage, the cheese and the sausage, it was fine, it was good. As soon as I got to the only, the sauce part of it, which was close to the crust, I kid you not, I started tasting blood. And I had no idea why. And I told my daughter, I said, wait. Cause I know I didn't have no scratches or no sores or no, no, no bad teeth or nothing like that that would start bleeding. But it was strange that when I got to the sauce, right at the, the crust, when I got to that sauce, I began to taste blood. And when I, after I had this dream, it reminded me of that. Something is going on with Papa John, trafficking, blood, and China. Something is going on with that. 
So my prayer is that God would bring light to this darkness in the mighty name of Jesus. If it's something hidden behind Papa John that's connected to trafficking, that's connected to China, that's connected to blood, that God will reveal it, that he will shine light in these dark places in the mighty name of Jesus. And if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, my prayers for your salvation, that you will repent of your sins, confess with your mouth and believe with your heart that Jesus Christ is Lord, and that he'll lead you and guide you to all truth in the mighty name of Jesus. So my another prayer is that people will have discernment before they go out eating in these different places, different restaurants. Let the Lord lead you and guide you to all truth and righteousness in the mighty name of Jesus. Until next time, don't forget, repent. Magnificent.